An extradition ruling on the controversial Spanish rapper Val Tonic has again been delayed. Belgian courts will decide on September 17 whether he should be sent back to Spain to face charges of glorifying terrorism. Appearing before a judge on Monday, he told journalists he was optimistic the charges won't stick. I'm happy because the prosecutor doesn't take the accusation of terrorism for granted, but at the same time I'm very sad because this shows that the Spanish state are making the word terrorism banal and they're using it as an excuse to crush dissent. Valtonic is also accused of insulting Spain's royal family and for making threats, which the defence considers inappropriate. There's no question of threats because it's, it's rap music, it's, it's like, you know, graffiti. You don't have to take it literally, it's hyperbolic. The judges will be taking the time to analyse the lyrics in the rapper's songs to determine whether they fit the crime. In Spain, he was sentenced to three and a half years in prison. Examples of his lyrics include wishing to blow up a bus full of politicians. Valtonic wants his case to set a precedent in favour of freedom of expression, and that's why he says that should his extradition be definitively approved, he's willing to go to the European Court of Human Rights in Strasbourg.